Good morning, guys. Mm -hmm. Guess where I am? I'm back in St. Louis again, and I wanted to show you guys the shoes I got last night because I posted on my Instagram and nobody liked them, so I want to see if you guys like them. But I went to Von Mar because it's like right next to my parents' house, and I am obsessed with Von Mar now. Like, it's my favorite store. So, the first pair that I got are by Naturalizer, and they're like these loafers with a little bit of a platform. Oh, naturalizers are for old people. That's okay. Okay. I'm getting old. You look cute. I do? Yeah, your makeup looks really good today. Thanks. Did, did you just put me on camera? Yeah. Honey, I have wet hair. I have no wet makeup. hair. Oh, well, there's a difference between yours and mine. <laughs> Anyways, these are them. They're so cute and like the sole is like super super squishy because they're like a like a comfort shoe, I guess. But I don't know. I feel like they look like kind of like like trendy. I don't know. I really really liked them. But the best part was they were $110 and I was like, "Let me check Macy's cuz Macy's is always running sales, especially this week cuz it's Black Friday." So I looked and these were $66 on Macy's website. So I told the Von Mar shoes lady and she said that they'll price match it. So they price matched these. So I saved whatever, however much that is, a lot. And then I got these Steve Madden boots too. I'll just show you guys. So then I got these Steve Madden boots too and I love these i saw both of these when i was here last time and i just like couldn't stop thinking about these shoes they've got like a little stripe in the back they also come with red laces and these were 129 at von mar and on macy's website they were 77 and so they price matched these as well all right so it is my transition lenses sorry guys i'm a dork um but it's pre-thanksgiving isn't that like wild turkey wednesday or something right so I am heading into Schnucks, because I'm in St. Louis now, and I'm gonna grab, Cal is napping, so I left him at my parents' house, my dad's there. So I took crew with me because I feel like, honestly, it's great to have help, but I feel like it's still a lot, like two kids is a lot for anybody. So I took crew with me, because um, it's a lot easier to just have one. Um, sorry, the lighting's so weird, there we go. Anyways, I'm running into here to get ingredients to make my famous cheesecake. I'll show you guys. I'll, I'll put the recipe down below. It's from Pinterest. I didn't like come up with it, but I make it like um, every year almost, and it's like a huge hit. So I need to get the ingredients for that. So I just want to run in here. Plus, I'm starving. It's already 11 o'clock. I haven't had a single thing to eat or a single sip of anything. So I might see if I can just grab like something quick inside of the grocery store that I can eat. And yeah, that's what we're gonna go do. And I look like a mess because, well, mom life. grocery store was insane but I don't know what I was expecting the day before Thanksgiving but crew was an angel I just came back to my parents house picked up Cal they're both in their PJs but honestly I don't know why it's just like I always feel more like rushed and scatterbrained when I'm like here versus when I'm at home where I like have everything like laid out and I like have a routine so I was just like you know what I'm just gonna bring them in their pajamas and I just tossed some outfits in the diaper bag and we can figure that out, but we're heading over to my brother's house and my sister-in-law is home and then her sister and her son, who's like the same age as Cal, are there. So they're gonna be able to play and I'll probably just like wear crew or let him sleep in the dock -tot or something while I make my cheesecake. All right, so I'm starting my cheesecake and the first thing is a packet of Oreos and you grind them all up to make the crust.
right, cheesecake's in the oven. It's been in there for, it goes in there for an hour and a half. Then it has to cool for three hours and then it goes in the refrigerator overnight. It's a super complicated recipe. But this little guy's over here blowing bubbles. Do you see yourself? <laughs> Are you still in your pajamas? <laughs> Just waiting for poop to fly out on you. <laughs> you were happy a second ago. The mom fuel. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my cheesecake. It hasn't even had the toppings on it yet. It's oh, still good. Hi guys, I did not update you at all last night. After I left my brother's house, I ended up going to a friend's house and with the kids um, to meet. They have a newborn baby, and so we were going over there to meet them, and everyone was bringing their kids, and it was a complete fiasco for me. Not everyone else, everyone else was fine. Everyone else's kids were great, but Crew had the worst meltdown he's ever had in his life. Like just unconsolable, would not stop crying. So it was really stressful, so I didn't even pull out the camera. Now it's Thanksgiving and I'm heading over to my in-laws family. Even though David's not with me, we're gonna go over there for a little bit and then we're going back over to my brother's house for Thanksgiving dinner. So I just thought I would update you guys. What is that, Cal? You gotta buckle up. Uh, I, I can't see. Can you see? You can't see? Blah, blah, blah. Where's your shoes? <laughs> this thing is huge, Cal. When do we put crew in next to him? <laughs> Can sit Another up. two weeks. <laughs> I mean, you can put the car seat in, probably. I mean, you can lay him in the back. <laughs> yeah, swaddle him and put him in the back. All right, we just got to my brother's house, second destination. Um, Cal got that car I showed you guys. That was so much fun for him. He is like totally passed out, though. And he's gonna go crazy in there because there's a bunch of kids. So I'm just like. Do I sit in here for a few minutes and let him sleep some more, or do we just go for it? Crew's also sleeping. vlogging right now but um, last night after Thanksgiving I ended up getting the biggest headache ever so we just went home and now we are oh no we're gonna attempt to Black Friday shop with a newborn and a toddler and we're also going dress shopping for my future sister-in-law so that is what we are about to do now baby Cal you're doing such a good job bride is in there. We got our Starbucks too, of course. I'll be right back. Okay. What do you think, bride? 
I like both of those too. They're so pretty. <laughs> and it's not, you have them in the right color. This is insane. Ooh, look at the Kate Spade line. Oh my god. <laughs> you and your mom have waited in that before? No, I've never waited in it. Oh, it's actually since you went on Friday shopping, it's all purses like two years ago. Oh, wait, actually, yeah, we have waited in it before. That's crazy. You guys, there's even a line for Nike. And every store basically has a line. This is insane. It's crazy. It's like 3 o'clock. No, what time is it? 1 30. Yeah. It's not morning. Can he? No, there's no there's not enough room, babe. This is impossible. There's literally so many people in here. because it would be a quiet spot and it's just insane. I'm basically ready to go. All right, we decided to come to my favorite store instead because they do not have the busy Black Friday crowds and this is Von Mar, if you didn't know. And they will price match anything, so. Where I'm high waisted. Yeah. Mine won't go up so high. Look. Oh. That's high waisted. Oh yeah, my. Oh my. Present. Oh. Oh. Yeah, get it. Stay in the back and hold it up. You blew it. get the boys pictures done with Santa. I'm so excited. Cal, let's go find Santa. Where do you think he is? Right there, the huge, gigantic. Line? Three hour line. Oh, it's not three hours. <laughs> this way, honey. Uh, 
This is the busiest I've ever seen this place. Cal, this way. It's not three hours. Come here. <laughs> How much time do we have? <laughs> Come on, Cal, this way. What do you want to do? I don't know. Well. Is he here tomorrow? Yeah, he's here tomorrow from 12 to 5. To tomorrow. What? Trying to vlog. Is he not good at it? Sure, oh, 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 why is it inside? It should probably be an outside toy, huh? <laughs> so, Christmas photos with Santa was a fail. Um, the line was just super, super long, and um, David's going golfing with my dad, so we didn't really have enough time to wait in line, and as you can he probably hear in the background, the crew was just not the happiest, so we, there was no way we could wait in the line that long with both of them, so not happening, but, um, David says that our country club has like a little like brunch with Santa type thing. So I think we'll do that. I think it's coming up pretty soon. So we'll do that and I'll definitely vlog it because I'm like excited to get Cal's reaction to seeing Santa this year because I think it'll be really fun. But I'm just a little bit disappointed. Um, but it's okay. Anyways, I think I'm going to finally end this vlog here because it's been like going on four days now of footage. But I hope you guys enjoyed our Thanksgiving weekend and I will see you in our next video. Bye. Thank you.